Hi, this is Noel from Benchmark, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use the inverse tool to get information on the distance to your point and on the slope information. So what I'm going to do to begin here is I'm going to select my first point. In this case, I wanna know the stats between point seven and nine. So I'm gonna hit point seven, I'm gonna hit the ruler there in the bottom left corner, and then I'm going to select my endpoint as point nine. And you can see here that I've got a red arrow now going from point seven to point nine. And what I'm going to do now to get my extra information on this, because I do have my distance and bearing, but I wanna get a little bit more information. I wanna also know my slope information between these two points. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit this info button here, and you're gonna see here that I get quite a bit more information on my inverse tool. You can see that I've got from point seven to nine, I've got a direction, a horizontal distance, a slope distance, a zenith angle, and a whole bunch of other information. So if you need a bit more information that isn't shown in your inverse tool, this little info button is a great way to see that information. And for now, that is everything in today's video. But if you have any questions about anything you've seen in today's video or any questions about anything you have seen on this YouTube channel, please give us a call at 1-888-286-3204 or visit us on the web at bench-mark.ca.